Hi guys, it's Erin. Um, I wanted to show you about Flipgrid. It is something that I plan on using in my classes during this distance learning time and thought it might be helpful for some of you. So this is the student view. I figured I would show you that first. Um, I plan on assigning a Flipgrid um, almost every time that I have class as a way to, as like attendance check-in. So they have to complete this by 4.15 that day. Um, and it will allow me to know that they've engaged with the class and um, so I can mark them present. So the first one I'm gonna do is a very simple one in English, very easy, um, just to make sure that they can get it to work. So the first one says, um, give some instructions, asking them how to, sh uh, to share how they feel about doing school from home. And they are going to then click on this plus sign here. It will open up a window like this, they will click here, record their message, and then they will submit it. Once they submit it, um, the response will show up here. And so to show you the educator view, this is the educator view. And so if they were to see this, I were to see this, I would see all of their replies here. Um, and I could also record my own response to share with them. Um, and so to show you the rest of my grids, um, for example, my Spanish 3 class, um, I, make it, I made one for three different days, the first three days of class. So the next one will be Thursday, April 2nd, and this time I typed the question here in Spanish. They are going to record a response the same way they did before in the student view by clicking on the giant um, plus sign. Then I'm also going to require that they respond to at least one other student in the class, um, their video. And so I need the, I'm going to ask for them for the response orally. Um, another example of what you can do as the teacher is you could put a video. So if I want them to hear the question from me. ¿Qué hicieron durante las vacaciones de primavera? So they can listen to my question and then they will record their response. And so it's a different way to get them to do it. So hopefully this is helpful. If you have any questions, please reach out.